I'm actually the worst YouTuber to ever exist because I forget that I'm supposed to be filming this. So I'm not a YouTuber. Anyways. Hello, welcome to my channel. Um, right now I'm sitting in the parking lot at um, the piercing place. My appointment is at 12 and it's 11.49 11 40, 11 right now. So I think I'm going to get my conch pierced. I put in the notes that I wanted my tragus when I booked the appointment. So um, hopefully it's a con. I could, you know, because I feel like it's the same. Anyways, yeah, I'm very excited. I don't know if I'm going to be able to film. Probably not. But I can like say like what aftercare she tells me you know what i mean so i'll see you later all right so just got it pierced it's silver so i took out my other jewelry because i normally wear gold but whatever she said in six weeks i could change it so i will it's 16 gauge i'm saying that to myself so that i remember later on the jewelry is 16 gauge leslie so when i go buy stuff i can put it in um to take it out she said when like i'm ready I hold the bottom, like hold onto the bottom of the ring, and then take my other hand and take the bead and pull up and it'll come out. So, um, pain, I'd say like a three out of 10. It doesn't hurt at all now. Like it doesn't even feel like I got a pierce. So, I don't know. It, I, I know pain tolerance all depends on like the person, um, but this was completely, didn't hurt at all. She was really nice, professional, clean. And she said I could use contact solution to, pardon, kill me. She said I could use contact solution to like clean it. And I never knew that. And I do have contact solution because I wear contacts. Hello. Um, but yeah, super clean. And I'm going to drive home. I'll probably do like a little update later on today to see how it is. All right. So it's been like 10 minutes since I got it. I'm home already. Um, but I want to show you, like it is red, but. It doesn't feel, it's not like throbbing or anything. It's not hurting. And this is the jewelry I want to put into it when it's healed. So yeah, it's really pretty and small and dainty. Um, but yeah, that's going to go inside once this is healed. This is just starter jewelry. Give me six weeks and this shit's coming out. All right, so pardon the lighting and the terrible video quality. I think the lighting is making the quality bad. Um, but... It's 8.51, so I'm going to be cleaning my conch piercing. I'm gonna wash my hands first off. All right, so now that my hands are clean, I am taking this Q-tip and my ability, the lady who pierced my ears, she said that I could clean this with contact solution and I wear contacts and I have a lot of contact solution. So I got some solution on there and I'm going to do this in the mirror, I don't care. Okay. Clean that. I'm very like aware that it is there, you know what I mean? It doesn't like throb or anything, but I'm very aware of its existence on my ear. Uh, it just feels like uncomfortable and I do not like the starter jewelry. This is like really like... This is very, um, janky for <laughs> me, but six weeks, six weeks, and do not comment talking about, you shouldn't touch it for six weeks. Shut up. I'm going to be cleaning it after I change this jewelry, but I am going to change this jewelry because it's ugly. It's not my vibe, okay? And also being pierced with a hoop, I hear, like, it causes more problems because it can be moved for, move, it's like moved back and forth more, so it can cause more problems. But it was my piercer's preference to use a hoop. And I don't know. As long as there was room for a swelling ring. I'll probably film when I change it. But do not come for me in the comments talking about. You can't touch it after. Shut up. I'm going to do what I want with it. After I change it, I'm not going to touch it again. You know what I mean? I'm not going to touch it for like a year. But I just need something cute because this is so ugly. I hate the jewelry. The piercing is cute. The jewelry is not hover. I'm gonna see how it is in six months. Obviously, if I have something like a piercing belt, I'm not gonna change it. Um, but we will see. Like, my nose piercing, I was pierced with a stud, and then I switched to a hoop after like six months. So, I did wait, but you know, different piercing. She said six weeks, I'm doing six weeks. Okay, 
Hey guys, next day and I slept on my right side, so I had no problems with this piercing at all. Um, let's not share my dirty desk. Um, but yeah, I had no problems with it sleeping up on the other side and didn't like flip over or whatever. Uh, but thank you guys for watching. I know it was a short video, so thank you. Subscribe, like, you know the drill. Alright, bye.